friends, welcome back to my channel. My name is Alvina Khazi and you are watching Alvina Khazi's channel. So today we are going to learn how 7 segment LED display works. So before rolling onto the screen, uh, we need to learn what is 7 segment display. From 0 to 9, uh, you can get uh, any number. It is used in uh, digital clock wristwatch lifts today I am going to show you the demo about working lift so let us roll on to my screen so I am going to show you what I have made that already I have done all these connections I know it looks complicated but it's easy if you start doing it now start simulation one that light close two second light close three third light close Four, fourth light close, five, fifth light close. Uh, I do not have any pins, uh, more pins over here, so I just made adjusting with these lights only. By seeing this, don't you remember one thing? Of course, uh, um, it is uh, usually found in lifts because uh, if it's in first floor, first light will glow first light will glow if it in second floor second light third floor third light so this is what we are going to do in this video so first you have to drag Arduino Uno on your main screen I've already opened Tinkercad if you want to uh, see how I open Tinkercad you can watch my previous video in which I have showed how to open Tinkercad step by step next after dragging Arduino Uno then I have to drag tra register control C and control V. Then over here you can see seven segment display under piezo, nothing but buzzer. Just drag that on the screen. Yeah. Click on this and just it was anode. Uh, click on cathode so that the light glows. So but to make you clear, I have made a presentation or PPT. So you can see my PPT out here. Yeah. First picture. Um, you can see A, B, C, D, E, F, G. A, B, C, D are the na names of the lines. So one. How can we form one? B and C. If we include B and C, one appears. So over here B is and over here C is. If we just uh, give power to these two pins, one will appear. Take this transistor and place one above and one here. You click on the middle one, common, and connect it to the terminal. I mean, connect it to the um, transistor. Now, take this and connect it to the upper GND. Now, take this one and connect it to, you see over here GND, E, right? I'm going to take it slowly and easily. So, E, I'm going to connect it to 1. Okay. Now, I'm going to connect A. A to 9 you can connect it to 1 2 3 4 but I suggest to do it like this because you're doing it first time you do you connect the numbers to the same number in which I'm connecting B to 8 next this G1 you have to connect this G to 7 You can also change the color of this wire because if you are thinking that no, it's too complicated. It's looking too complicated for us. I want to identify it. T, I'm going to connect it to 2. See, I'm going to connect it to 3. So click on basic. I'm going to give a bit twist in this. One LED light another LED light I, over here I'm just going to show you three um, seven segment uh, seven segment will show from one to three because the coding will be too long and the video will go too long so let us start by this wiring I'm going to take this up here take it down neatly 
and connect it with G and D. G and D is for gram once again. And with the same G and D. Now it's time for me to connect this anode. F only. Ten. I want to connect it with ten. You can do the code even better. Let me go it from go. Let's take this one blocks on uh, control and uh, here. Then you have to go three because C and D, uh, C and B makes uh, one. So I have connected C, C to three. So three and uh, I have connected this B to it. Um, will be gated. Let's see whether this is working or not. Start simulation. Of course, it's working. Now it's two time one, two, three, four, five. Five uh, lines make two, one, two, three, four, and let's go. And five. Now control and this goes up. Now the numbers are nine eight seven one nine eight 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 seven one two. Now duplicate this. Duplicate and here we go. Next, you have to low again, low one, two, three, four. And five and the number ending nine eight three two seven two seven control and this one out here. Now let's see whether it's working or not. One, two, three. We want this LED light to glow at the same time. So for this, uh, what we are going to do is we are going to take another extra block, and I want ten, ten and a half, and I want it to become again low then. Then, 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 which then, yeah, it's fine. And from here, let's just take out one. And I want 11 to glow when the two works. And let's put this out here. Again, 11. And low. And 12. Low. And over here, 12. Let's just check out. One, yeah, two, mm -hmm. three, yes, it's working. Uh, it's better when you just change the color of it. I want one blue, white will be better. And let this be yellow, yeah, yellow. Now, utilizing one, two, and three, yay, we did it. Our uh, seven segment display is working as well as the lights are glowing. So, thanks for watching this video. Like, share, subscribe to our channel, and press the bell icon for upcoming videos. Bye.